Hello, welcome back to Jack and Erica. Today, we're actually going to build a baby bed. For those of you that don't know, Erica is pregnant. She's about 24 weeks pregnant now. And um, our parents got us a baby bed. So we're going to bring you along while we build it. The baby bed that we are going to have for our baby is actually this Delta. And it's the Jordan 4-in-1 convertible crib. Uh, we picked this up, or actually our families picked this up from Target. And this is the gray color that we decided to go with. We'll put a link down in the description of the exact one that we decided to go with. But the one reason that we did go with the Delta Children um, convertible crib was just because Delta gives 10% of all their profits back to improving the lives of children, which we thought was great. Since this is a four in one, you might be asking what does the four in one mean? So the four in one means that it goes from a crib to a toddler bed to a day bed and then ultimately a sofa. So that's one reason, another reason actually why we like this one. And we can insert photos here to show you each step of it going from a crib to a toddler bed to a day bed to a sofa. You know it's cold in Florida when your husband has on socks with slippies. <laughs> <laughs> it's my best working clothes. Once we got the box open, they came with some instructions. Um, you know, I probably won't use these. <laughs> but Erica will, and then she'll tell me everything that I'm doing wrong. And then I'll go to her and say, okay, how do I go about building this bed? On top is the mattress support frame. This is what the color looks like. I don't know if it's picking it up very well, but it's like a light gray. We aren't finding out the gender of our baby that's coming. So I tried to pick something that was neutral. And um, this Delta brand was a lot more affordable than some of the other brands too. So if you're on a budget, um, look into Delta because I thought their pricing was pretty reasonable. It's all unboxed. Everything looks like it's in good condition. I was a little worried because the box that it came in had some holes in it and I read some of the reviews beforehand and some of the people that wrote in the review said that theirs showed up damaged. So luckily ours did not so we don't have to worry about returning anything and let's continue building. Just to show you another shot, this is kind of how ours showed up. So there was this big gash in it and I was worried that it might have been damaged, but it wasn't. The one thing I liked about this bed was that the legs, if I open them up here, are wooden so it's like gray and wooden um, I want Jack to build the dresser slash changing table that we're gonna put in the room and then we'll probably stain it this lighter color that way it all ties in together and he lied he already needs the instructions <laughs> I do have to say Delta gets an A plus on how they package their hardware like I've never seen a company package their hardware this nice before so Kudos to Delta Children for how they package their hardware. Much better than what you get with Ikea, because Ikea, we've always taken forever to build anything we've ever bought from them. So we are working through step one. <laughs> Moving on to step two, now we're gonna put one of the sides in. So we put the bottom rail in as step one on the sides. Then they recommend we put in the side rail or like the side gate, I guess they call it. And then uh, we'll secure that and then we'll move on to the second side. A little finagling and we got the side in. Just took two people. Do you remember, as kids, anytime you had these bars, you pretended like you were in jail? <laughs> <laughs> or was that just me? <laughs> now he's tightening these bolts with an Allen wrench. Slowly but surely. Or his fingers, whatever works. <laughs> <laughs> Did anybody else have a hard time getting the Allen wrench in the hole? <laughs> That's what he said. I'm taking my 15 minute break. 
because she said I was taking too long to get the Allen wrench in the screw. So she's taking over. You know for that one you don't have to pull it out. Can I do now? <laughs> <laughs> oh. And she dropped it. <laughs> So this side of the bed actually goes together a little differently. So you put the dowels in here. You grab your side rail. You line up the dowels. Like so. And then ultimately we're going to put the dowels in here and then put it right inside there. Wrong one. That was a lot easier than the first set. <laughs> <laughs> We slipped it in there and then we decided to put the big bolts that go here through the end. And then ultimately we added the six bolts on the side. And now we're just going to go around and tighten them as you can see. Eric has already started on this side. So once again, I have to give credit to Delta Children because they have created the best design Allen wrench I've ever seen. So it might be hard to see on here. So I'm gonna turn the camera around and zoom in. So if you look at the tip of this Allen, it's actually you're like, uh, let's see if it'll focus. There. It's like beveled. So you can take this Allen wrench, come into the little nooks and crannies here, and you can still be able to tighten the screw down. This is a genius design by them. And we have four sides. Woohoo! <laughs> now that we have all four sides, like Erica mentioned, now we're going to go ahead and uh, place the seat assembly, uh, feet assembly <laughs> here. And um, what I wanted to show is like on the back side, there's like a nut that the feet actually screw into. So that's going to be upside down for the crib so that the design feature is more of this bevel that bevels out. So the feet are on. Now I'm going to flip it over and then we're going to put the mattress support in the middle and then we'll be all finished up. Muscles! <laughs> there we are. Good job. There it is. Thanks for hanging out with us as we built our baby crib. It was a fun adventure for Eric and I, and we're so happy that we brought you along with us. And uh, thanks for joining us, and we'll see you around like a donut. <laughs>